I guess to be avant-garde in the film industry is to be avant-garde in, in anything in life, right? It's not to ingest convention too much, to be in the film industry but not be of it. It's been great to be a part of this new phase of the Marvel Universe. I ended up changing Valkyrie from its original uh, conception in the comics just by being me. In the comics is a very tall Nordic white woman with blonde hair and I'm none of those things. And luckily because I think people responded to the character and liked it, I think it's a good reminder that who we are and what we are has to do with who we are as people and not the color of our skin. I was raised with a tremendous amount of freedom and to dress however I wanted to dress and play in the way that I wanted to play. I think there's so much change that needs to be done inside of the film industry as it relates to, to women, to the images that we put out there. We need to be projected in film as the nuanced, sort of complicated beings that we are. Create characters that look and feel like the women that we know and love. And I think a part of that is just owning your own power. I mean, there's so many incredible women that inspire me. All of the women that seem to change our ideas about femininity, that had a certain strength about them, and even a, a touch of androgyny that they towed the line between masculine and feminine. Jane Fonda, Lupita, Angela Bassett. I remember the first time I saw Betty Davis on screen. There's so many. Who doesn't inspire me?